Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. In every work environment, careful planning and the provision of sufficient clearances and working spaces greatly increase worker efficiency and productivity. They also help in mitigating property damages as well as physical injuries to workers in case of accidents. In this video, we are going to talk about the spacing and clearance requirements that need to be considered when laying out dragon fruit trellises. The recommendations provided in this video are based on lessons learned gained from actual experiences and research as well as from consultation with other dragon fruit growers. By the end of this video, you should be able to answer the following questions. What is the ideal height of dragon fruit trellises? What is the minimum walking working space requirement around the dragon fruit plant? What is the ideal space between trellises. How far should the first trellis be from the fence? What is the ideal height of dragon fruit trellises? It is recommended to limit the height of the trellises to 5 feet or 1.5 meters. Any additional length above that would be unnecessary. The higher your trellis is, the harder it would be to work on them. The ideal height should enable you to easily harvest fruits, do some pruning, carry out inspection, apply treatment for diseases, as well as to do hand pollination if necessary. Note that some varieties of dragon fruits require hand pollination to produce fruits. It would be hard to do all these works if you set the trellises too high for your height. What is the minimum walking working space around a dragon fruit plant? Consider this picture. Here, the trellises are too close to each other that their vines are already touching each other. There is no clearance to walk or work between them. Worse, there are pineapple plants in there, making it even harder to access. Having adequate space would make it easier for you to do work, such as watering, harvesting, pruning, inspection, treatment, and hand pollination around the plant. Ideally, there should be a minimum of 2 foot 6 or 760 60 mm clearance between the hanging stems of dragon fruit plants on both sides. This clearance would allow you to walk and move easily around the plants without hurting yourself or heating and damaging the plants. Note that dragon fruit can actually grow as big as you allow them to. In order to keep them within a manageable size, you need to do regular maintenance on them. You have to prune them back while being careful not to hinder fruiting. Dragon fruit plants actually fruit best once they have reached the top of the trellis and have hung outwards and down away from the support. Knowing that, you should allow them to grow to reach the top of the trellis and to hang outwards. Just prune them to keep the vines from growing too long that they block access or touch the ground or other plants. What is the ideal spacing between trellises? In order to avoid over pruning the plants, you should allow sufficient space for it to grow. The recommended spacing between rows of dragon fruit trellises is 10 feet or 3 meters. With a 2 foot 6 to 3 feet wide walking or working space in between, you would have a remaining envelope of 7 to 7 foot 6 diameter for the plant to grow. If you want to maximize the number of plants in your farm, you can have single pole trellises spaced at 7 feet or 2 meters on centers in rows that are 10 feet or 3 meters apart. Here is a sample layout. Here, the horizontal lines of dragon fruit trellises have been designated as row 1, row 2, and row 3. These rows are spaced 10 feet or 3 meters on centers and have designated walking, working corridors in between. A cross access is also provided between lines 6 and 7, which are spaced 10 feet or 3 meters apart. You can arbitrarily locate your cross access, but my recommendation is to provide one every 10 trellises. How far should the first trellis be from the fence? This picture shows dragon fruit trellises that are too close to the fence. Try to avoid this situation as much as possible. The fence will make it hard for anybody to work on the back side of the trellises once these plants are fully grown. Ideally, you should be able to go in between the plant and the fence to provide a 2 foot 6 or 760 mm walking, walking space. Locate the trellis 6 feet or 1.88 meters from the face of the fence. Now, let's summarize what we have talked about so far. The recommended height of a single pole trellis is 5 feet or 1.5 meters. The minimum width of walking working space is 2 foot 6 or 760 millimeters. The recommended spacing between dragon fruit trellises within a row is 7 feet or 2 meters and that between rows is 10 feet or 3 meters. The recommended minimum distance of the first trellis from the face of the fence wall is 6 feet or 1.88 meters. 
meters. This illustration provides a summary of everything we have talked about so far in this video. If you have any question, just leave a comment below and we will get back to you as soon as we can. This concludes our presentation. If you like this video and this is your first time to visit this channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can be updated of our next videos. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Thank you.